Hey, what's up? Jigsaw here. Ever experienced the couldn't restore WhatsApp chat history type of error on WhatsApp? In this video, I'll show you some solutions on how to fix this issue on your iPhone. Let's go. One of the problems is the chat history restoration error. This error can cause problems with messages and important media files. Generally, users will want to backup WhatsApp messages to a new phone with cloud backup. Android users are expected to backup WhatsApp data to Google Drive, while Apple users can backup WhatsApp messages to iCloud. There are several possible solutions that I'll introduce to you to restore the chat history. The first method is to check the available storage space. Make sure you have enough storage space to download and restore your WhatsApp backup data. This is one of the main reasons for the error. To check this on your iPhone, head into Settings. Go to General and find iPhone storage. See if there's enough storage at least 10 gigabytes or more. Also, simply check your internet connection. One of the easiest ways to check if the internet is working is to browse. Afterward, check to see if your WhatsApp is up to date. Outdated versions can cause problems and prevent you from restoring your chat history. That's why it's essential to go to the App Store and see if WhatsApp has any pending updates. Click here your icon in the top right corner and check if there's an update button next to WhatsApp. Click on it to begin updating. Another method is to disable and then re-enable iCloud Drive. This can fix your problem because it causes iCloud to work properly again. Here's how to do it. Go to the Settings app on your iPhone. Tap your username. From there, locate the iCloud option. Then click on iCloud Drive. Lastly, toggle iCloud Drive off and on. Next off is forcing your device to reboot, which also resolves the issue. For iPhones with Face ID such as iPhone 10, iPhone 11, or any newer model, do the following steps. The following procedure also applies for iPhone 8 and iPhone SE. Press and quickly release the volume up and volume down buttons respectively. Then press and hold the side button. Once the Apple logo appears, release the side button and wait for your iPhone to restart. On the other hand, the process is slightly different on the iPhone 7. In this case, you need to press and hold both the volume down and side buttons simultaneously. Continue holding both buttons until the Apple logo appears on the screen. For those with an iPhone 6S or earlier, press and hold both the sleep and home buttons at the same time. Keep holding both buttons and release them when the Apple logo appears. Maybe you're also wondering if you can restore WhatsApp from Google Drive to iCloud. As we all know, iCloud is for iPhones and Google Drive is for Androids. Instead of using cloud services, which cannot work together, I recommend using software on a PC. This tool was specifically designed for that purpose, so you can be sure it works. There is one third-party alternative that's the best and easiest when it comes to recovering WhatsApp chats. This software allows you to move your WhatsApp data effortlessly. And it doesn't only work for iPhone users, because Android users can use it at the same time. Like messages and chat histories, media like videos and images, contacts and documents, and it can also transfer WhatsApp business. You can check my link below to download it for free now. To use it, connect your device to your computer with a USB cable. Open the tool on your computer and select WhatsApp. From the left sidebar menu, click Restore and View. After confirming the connected device, click Restore. A pop-up window will ask you if you really want to restore WhatsApp to your device. Just click Restore to start. Make sure you follow the instructions flashed on the screen and continue with the process. Wait for the process to complete. Then click Done to exit. That's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions about the video or want me to create a tutorial about another topic, leave a comment below. See you next time. Bye.